So what reforms, according to you, can the Indian government take to attract more global companies, particularly U.S. investors? I think it's important to understand that uh, India is going to become a, it's a $4 trillion economy. Mm. By 2027, it will become a $5 trillion economy. Mm. And long-term vision is by you know 2047, it will be a $30 trillion economy. Yeah. So I think that's a market opportunity for global companies to look at India. But more important is we need FDI coming in. We need technology coming in because the biggest challenge this government has and the country has is job creation. If we don't create jobs, the youth uh, will, will be basically unsettled and you'll have pressure on the society to manage them. So I think job creation becomes number one uh, objective of this government. We need to make sure that the multinational coming into the country yeah. are dealing with a very stable, transparent policy making. And then making sure the process are very simple. Uh, today, when we look at, uh, you know, for example, KYC uh, for companies, they're different uh, by the uh, RBI, by the regulators. And I think we need to make simplify the process. The taxes are complicated. Yeah. The dispute resolution is long term. Uh, you have to go to the court. We need to be able to figure out a way to settle disputes outside the court also. So I think we need to simplify these processes. Because otherwise, if we don't simplify, they will go to Vietnam, Cambodia, Thailand. Yes, they're smaller countries with a smaller market. But I think you have to understand that if these countries want to come into India, they need to feel that we have a long-term game plan. It's a simple process and it's a fair process.